were you guys talking about that and uh, you were going to be posting up and uh, was she looking for you more down low in, in the post? I think we just, you know, knew that was going to be open. Um, just when I felt my defender step up a little bit, I was slip a spin. It was just really offensive. Her as a guard just seeing me and she was like, wow, she's open. She just throw it, you know. Me just being ready in general, I think I'm getting used to, starting to get used to them passing the ball. And, um, like I say, it comes with playing with each other and not with playing. So, you know, she's getting used to how I like getting them, mm -hmm. getting used to how she plays. Yeah, I could see you um, setting up and getting a position uh, and having your defender on your hip and it seemed like Chelsea, just at the right time, she could see that you had her and then she'd drop a dime to you and um, you convert it. Chelsea's a great passer. Um, she the way she can throw it to where you're supposed to be. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Make sure you get there. You know. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. She just playing with her, and just knowing. That, you know, maybe it don't look like she about to pass it, but she's gonna pass it. Like I said before, it comes with time. You know, at first it used to be like, <laughs> and I yeah. was able to get it and convert. So Good, yeah. time. Can you what's, talk about what's your assessment of your contribution tonight? Um, I thought I played well. You know, did my job. Uh, Whatever, I mean, I'm, I'm starting to think less. I thought I thought a lot less. I was more decisive than what I wanted to do on offense. Um, on defense, I was my usual physical self. Um, you know, I got um, got a block shots, just having each other back on defense. Um, you know, I thought I did well. Can you talk about the bench contribution of you and Alexis just almost being close to double, di double, double uh, um, close to 10 points? Just talk about how aggressive you guys were for um, You know, we just talk about being ready when your number's called. You know, Lex just coming back um, from a little small injury that she had. Um, for her to play like that, you know, she was just ready. Um, I think we all were excited to play and just, you know, whenever we got in those offensive slumps, um, people like Lex were, me and Lex were able to pick it up a little bit, um, make something happen, change the momentum a little bit. How did you enjoy this past week? What did you do to you know, relax and have fun this past week? I chased after a toddler. You chased after what? A toddler. Okay. It seems yeah. to, I didn't do anything. You seem to have had a nice moment with Liz before the game. <laughs> Yeah, um, you know, it's important to hug it out, you know, we shouldn't be against each other, you know, we should be for each other, you know, stick together, so, I mean, that doesn't change the fact that we was going to go at each other, I don't think that was the case, but, you know, just, I know that's not who she is, and, you know, stuff happens, so. Is it, is it fair to... No, go ahead. Is it fair to say that uh, you playing Liz and you playing Ace is brings out the best in you? Uh... I don't know how to answer that. I just feel like you like go to a, a different level every time you play against them. Am I not on a different level in other games? You are. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in Paris. I'm just playing. No, no, no. Um, I really think it, had, it didn't really have nothing to do with them as a team. If we know we have a really good team coming out the gate. You it's the antsy to play. You're excited to play. You know, that little break was just what we needed. Um, so I was just excited to get back on the court. <laughs> That's why. It's all good. How imperative was it to get Liz campaign in foul trouble early to kind of control the tempo, especially in the first half? Um, we know she was a big uh, offensive part of their, you know, her playing. Um, and we just wanted to, you know, her getting in foul trouble, that takes away a lot. So our guards to get to the paint, you know, and not really necessarily her altering their shots. Um, I don't know. Um, just frustrate her as much as possible, I guess. How much confidence did you guys have, especially ending the third quarter on a 13-4 run uh, with Candace Parker, you know, sitting on the bench? Uh, it was pretty good. Um, you know, uh, we were just picking up the slack at the bench. You know, we had gotten into a little slump, offensive slump. Um, coach put his hand and we just went to work, you know. What do you think it took to hold the team to eight points? Like, they only scored eight points in the fourth quarter alone. <laughs> what do you think it took? Us trusting each other, I think, um, you know, we've been working on that in practice, just knowing that person's going to have your back if you go. And I thought in that, that fourth quarter, we really did that. People were in health side and where they were supposed to be and trusted that people were going to have their back. And um, it just happened for us. Sorry if someone already asked this, but um, 